Heat transfer is a discipline of thermal engineering that concerns the generation, use, conversion, and exchange of thermal energy, heat, between physical systems. Heat transfer is classified into various mechanisms, such as thermal conduction, thermal convection, and thermal radiation. We are going to discuss the basic heat transfer questions and answers, which are helpful for interviews, government exams, gate and other competitive exams, and also you get the previously studied concepts revision by watching these video. Don't forget to subscribe our channel and like our video. Let's start the video. Question number 1. What is meant by dry bulb temperature? Answer. The temperature recorded by the thermometer with a dry bulb. The dry bulb thermometer cannot affect by the moisture present in the air. It is the measure of sensible heat of the air. Question number 2. What is meant by wet bulb temperature? Answer. It is the temperature recorded by a thermometer whose bulb is covered with cotton wick, wet, saturated with water. The wet bulb temperature may be the measure of enthalpy of air. Wet bulb temperature is the lowest temp Question number 3. Difference between sensible heat and latent heat? Answer. Sensible heat is the heat that changes the temperature of the substance when added to it or when abstracted from it. Latent heat is the heat that does not affect the temperature but change of state occurred by adding the heat or by a question number 4 difference between relative humidity and specific humidity answer relative humidity it is defined as the ratio of partial pressure of water vapor in a mixture to the saturation pressure of pure water at the same temperature of mixture specific humidity it is defined as the ratio of the mass of water vapor in a given volume to the mass of dry air in a given volume. Question number 5. Differentiate absolute humidity and relative humidity. Answer. Absolute humidity is the mass of water vapor present in 1 kg of dry air. Absolute humidity is expressed in terms of kg slash kg of dry air. Relative humidity is the ratio of the actual mass of water vapor present in 1 kg of dry air at the given temperature to the maximum mass of water vapor it can withhold at the same temperature. Relative Question number 6. What is humidification and dehumidification? Answer. The addition of water vapor into air is humidification and the removal of water vapor from air is the humidification. Question number 7. What is dew point temperature? Answer. The temperature at which the vapor starts condensing is called dew point temperature. It is also equal to the saturation temperature at the partial pressure of water vapor in the mixture. The dew point temperature is an indication of specific question number 8. What is effective temperature? Answer. The effective temperature is a measure of feeling warmth or cold to the human body in response to their temperature, moisture content and air motion. If the air at different dry bulb temperature and relative humidity condition carries the same amount of heat as the heat carried by the air at temperature T and 100% relative humidity, then the temperature T is known as effective temperature. Question number 9. Difference between degree of saturation and dew point depression? Answer. Degree of saturation, it is the ratio of the actual specific humidity and the saturated specific humidity at the same temperature of the mixture. Dew point depression, it is the difference between dry bulb temperature and dew point temperature of air vapor mixture. Do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching video. Please press like, comments, and subscribe button for update notification new video. Our important video link and playlist video name are share in the description box. Thanks and wait for our next video.